My name is Tyrone Hayes. I'm a professor in the Department of Integrative Biology at the University of California, Berkeley. My main interest, my main goal is to try to understand the environment and how it affects an organism's development. And for the last 15 years or so, I've been studying atrazine, which is an endocrine disruptor that interferes with reproductive hormones in amphibians and really across vertebrate animals in general. An endocrine disruptor can be anything that interferes with the synthesis, the production, the release, the function or the degradation of a natural hormone. We as humans, as vertebrates, we all use the exact same hormones as fish and frogs and reptiles and birds. Um, so if something's interfering with testosterone in a frog or estrogen or inducing estrogen in a frog or a fish, it's very likely doing the same thing in humans. And those hormones are important in our development, our reproductive development, as well as in a number of reproductive or hormone-dependent cancers, such as breast cancer and prostate cancer. We know now that very little of cancer is genetic, that cancer is an environmental disease. And, and so now the question becomes one of environmental justice. Because of the increased exposure, is that why you see such health disparities across racial and socioeconomic groups as well? I've always been interested in science. I've always been interested in biology and wildlife and the interaction between animals and the environment has just always been an interest that's been with me for as long as I can remember.